why am I here? Facebook reminded me that today, one year ago today, was the first episode of Eric Leviton Whiskey Aficionado, which recently I thought I should have named it Whiskey Aficionado, starring Professor Whiskey. The thought, thought I had, just call me Professor Whiskey. I don't know, just a thought. Anyhow, I thought it was like at the end of the month. I really did. So it kind of kind of shocked me, and I thought I should do something for the anniversary. So I decided to go buy a bottle. And I couldn't choose between two bottles, so I bought two bottles. We're going to try them both. But let's start with the first one, shall we? In no particular order. Today, we are having... Dun, da, 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 a Tom a Tin. That's not how you pronounce it. It's actually Tomatin. Tomatin, tomato, let's call the whole thing off. But that's what we're trying today. I've been wanting to try this for a little while, and I have the bottle right here. It's 12 years old. It is a Highland single malt Scotch whiskey. It's aged in bourbon and sherry casks. Now, Tomatin has been around since 1897, and they call themselves the softer side of the Highlands. So today, we're going to try it out. Oh, I'm so looking forward to this. So let's open it up, shall we? <laughs> Haven't heard that sound in quite a long time. You know which I'm going to say. Say it with me. Let's nose it. Oh. Ooh. Let's take our time with it, shall we? Oh, it's lovely. Hmm. It's been a while. Give me a second, would you? Don't rush me. Okay, I'm smelling some pine. It's soft. It's fruity. It's creamy. I want to say apples. Maybe pears. Something something different. Like um like a tropical fruit. But I can't quite put my finger on it. Papaya, mango, something like that, something that I wouldn't really be expecting. But it's very fruity. It's been a long time since I've done that, and it feels really good. Reunited, and it feels so good. Yeah, let's drink it, shall we? Up yours, and happy anniversary. smooth oh oh the prickly little taste buds on the tongue are going crazy now I don't know if that's because of the tomatin or just because it's been months since I've really done this oh that's really nice but right basically I got just overwhelmed by that first sip so let's take a second one okay so many things in not any particular order creamy caramely almost not vanilla caramel kind of thing the fruit is is it's like it's like a fruit salad i'm not really getting any one that's stepping out they're all just coming at you all at once it's not sweet it's it's tart it's a little tart oh <sighs> it's really good it's good the more you get into it and the finish is um between the, the bourbon and the sherry casks that's the finish you're getting just a little bit of the sherry, more of the bourbon, in my opinion. And, um, oh my gosh, it's lovely. Well, you know what we're going to do now? A little drop. That was a big drop, but it was just a drop. Let's see what that does, shall we? Now it's more, instead of pines, it's more like leaves, like a fall, like a fall in a wind, in a woods. And the, and the fruits are mustier now, and, and like they've been aged a little bit. Let's drink it. Oh, smooths it out. Oh, yeah, much more creamy now. Oh, oh, that is lovely just sitting on the tongue. I'm not kidding. It's really, really tasty. And the bourbon, wow, now we get a little more of the sherry cast than the bourbon, which is interesting to me. I don't know why, but it is. Without the water, it attacks a little uh, harder and a little faster. Without With the water in it, it's smoother. But that cream, that caramel cream, 
is really lovely. And it feels like it has a thickness to it. You know what I'm saying? When it sits, sits in your tongue, it doesn't just go away. It kind of sits there and, and enjoys its time on top of your taste buds before it goes down your throat. Oh, it's very lovely. I'm so glad I got to share this with you right here on Eric Leviton Whiskey Aficionado, otherwise known as Professor Whiskey, with two E's, no Y. That is my full and complete analysis on tomatin, not tomatin, not tomatone, not tom and tin, no, no, tomatin. Let's not call the whole thing off. It's very good. We have one more to do. I'll see you then.